ask you nicely to put aside your busy ways. Put down your cell phones and take some action and give us back our rightful future day. The Kamloops Red Rebels are silently protesting the Trans Mountain Pipeline today. When we hold our, our bodies like this, we're feeling love for the land. And this is sorrow for the climate change. So it moves from emotion to emotion through the emotions that we feel when we think about climate change. Grief for the land that we're going to lose joy for what we've had and what we hope to have in the future. The protests took place on Sequetmik land, an area where many people and families live nearby. If a spill actually occurs in our territory, this is like one of the largest spawning uh, ground beds. We've uh, gathered our salmon throughout uh, time and memorial, so uh, a spill occurring um, would affect everyone downstream all the way up to Alaska. The impacts are really, really uh, catastrophic if a spill ever occurs and we're here to say we're not allowed to uh, allowing that to happen here. I hope that people in Kamloops take a look at this beautiful place we call home and this river and and think about the fact that they're planning on drilling an oil pipeline underneath this water and the chances of us not having a disaster in Kamloops are very small. For Castanet Kamloops, I'm Amanda Lena Leterio.